Today, waking up and seeing just a perfectly blue sky, not a cloud in the sky, was awesome. And no one was really concerned that we hadn't ridden the pipe yet. Gretchen somehow got the weather involved and got everything to work out perfect. So we got powder days, we got sunshine. I mean, it was pretty much creme de la creme. This is why I snowboard. Like, it, like being with your friends, like beautiful weather, like a perfectly built half pipe and just progression. Like that's what I love. Beautiful oh, out. Yeah. I'm right. so glad we didn't do the contest today. Oh, yeah, we all would have woken up today and been yeah, like, no! <laughs> So the plan is to do an hour and 15 minute jam session and it's judged on overall impression for like the whole session. The judges will rank everyone one through 15 and then we'll do three individual prizes for highest air, best trick and overall most progressive riding. Personally, I, I like the jam format. It uh, really makes for progressive riding. We saw tricks today that we haven't seen from the girls all year because they simply had the opportunity to do it. Jammed format is by far the most progressive format you could have for a contest. It's the, that's what I always want to ride because you have an hour to, first of all, just land a run. And then once you land your run, it's like, why not try maybe tricks you've never tried before, tricks that you have a harder time with because you've got a full hour to try and land it. And if you do, then you're going to win. When you have like the three run or two run final, like everyone's so bound up about these two runs they need to land and what they're gonna do after they land this or that and, and if this works out and what they get scored on. But I feel like the jam format just lets everybody kind of be like, you're gonna have a, as many runs as you really need to have and you can do whatever you want. So it just lets everybody kind of ride like they do in practice and it just brings out such a different level of like energy, camaraderie, and of course riding. I was so impressed and inspired. Uh, you know, Maddie doing a switch backside seven, Caitlin and Ellery doing cab nines, and it was just very, very impressive. These young girls are super fun to watch, and that you can see that they're like progressing and learning in every run, especially in this jam format. So you see like Maddie Schaffrey, you see Ellery, you see all these girls, like, yeah, why not? Let's go for a nine, let's go for a seven, let's go backwards and up sound. Oh, oh. I had a really good time because I tried runs that I haven't really been doing all season and you can just mix up your runs which was really fun for me because I, I was trying some back sevens and then some cab sevens 
and then some rounds I was doing nines. It was just fun because you could mix it up. I really like seeing Kelly switch up her run. She's just so consistent and she's just such a great overall rider. But today I saw her throw runs that I've never seen her throw before. One of my favorite things to do is just go as fast as I can and <laughs> go as big as I can. So that's always just a lot of fun for me. Watching Gretchen progress and kind of like be like, just work through that crippler and like, okay, I want to do a crippler on the first hit and then to kind of just pull it out and do it one solid run. It was, it was interesting to see just you know, she wanted to do well in the contest, it's her event, and to see that she, you know, worked through it in an hour and got a good run in I that was kind of cool. $2,000 richer from Connecticut. Ellery Hawsworth with a cap nine at the bottom of the pipe here. I was really happy when they called me up for third place because, I don't know, it was just kind of the icing on the cake, I guess, because it was just a fun day of riding. Here we go, second place. Your hostess with the Moses, Gretchen Meyer. First place, first place. That's right. Kelly Clark. You know, I think it's it's hard to compare, I think, events and, and this, you know, what does it mean to you or how does it feel to win um, for me to win this event here. Me to win this event here is just a, a really nice addition to a great career. Kelly has had this year. It's really just kind of all come together for her, which is good to see. And then Ellery is just charging, you know? She's been this up-and-comer for a couple of years now, and I think this year she's not an up-and-comer anymore. She's she's here, and she's throwing some big tricks and riding really, really well. So it's, it's always fun to share the podium with those girls. Just about everything about this event is done really well, and they just make it a real enjoyable, fun event. So, uh... Definitely, if this happens again, I'll be here. I think my favorite day, part of the day, was um, the jam format. Don't you wish every contest could be a jam? So much more entertaining for everyone. Mine was a half-pipe contest that started at 11. Yeah. Good call. <laughs> I agree. I thoroughly enjoyed that. I agree. <laughs> Although, I felt like it was still a little too early for me. <laughs>